Ghost. Yeah, there we go. See, look how easy that was. All it took was one revive to beat him. Let's do this. Using the power of mana, a civilization had grown strong. In time, mana was used to create the ultimate weapon, the Mana Fortress. This angered the gods. They sent their beasts to destroy the fortress. A violent war rocked the world, and mana seemed to disappear. Before all was lost, a hero with the mana sword smashed the fortress. Though the civilization had been destroyed, the world was peaceful again. But time flows like a river, and history repeats. Ooh, scary, ominous. Ooh. Okay, here we go. Hey, wait a minute. Okay, this might be the one and only time I ever seen a protagonist of a JRPG actually talk. Oh, shoot, they're talk. Uh, shh, be quiet. Delta will find us here and he'll be mad. Yeah, we're not supposed to be here. There's a ghost. There's a ghost around. Ha, huh, do you really believe that? People say that to scare us. But I heard Grandma say something about a shiny object near the falls. That must be some kind of treasure. We have to find it. Help, I'm falling. Ah! Ah! Ah, look, those two guys are just like, oh, he fell. I guess we should help him. Oh, good God. You must be pretty tough to be able to handle a fall like that. Ouch. Phew. No way to get back up. Now, what am I going to do? Hmm, okay. What the hell is that? Why I start glowing? That was weird. Nope. Okay. Bunch of rocks at. You just can't seem to get past. Vault. Vault. Huh? What was that? Oh yeah, the, the sword. The village is this way. I have to find something to cut through. Yes, let's get the sword. We need it. It's our, it's our future, our destiny. Vault, remove the sword. Who are you? And what's the sword doing here? Huh? Ow, that light, so bright I can't see. Ghost. Vault, it is I who asked the sword. Huh? What? Say what? You mean this sword? I'm a little slow in the dialogue because it's just going so fast. Oh, right, I didn't even notice the shininess. <laughs> Oh, cool, we got our HP bar now. The brilliant light is gone in an instant. I have to get back. Okay, can I access the menu yet? Window edit. I don't like the whole stupid background thingy. When I see A, I think of X, or because I'm so used to PlayStation. All right, let's uh, change it to a bit of purple. There we go, that looks like my color. No, maybe darker. Yeah, there we go. See, now that works perfectly. All right, we're done. Let's go to the village. Slash, 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 easy peasy. Lemon squeezy. Whoa, what's that? What's a rabbit doing in a place like this? Yikes, that color is insanely bright. Let's uh change that. Okay, I think that should be good. Hopefully. Go away. Crazy evil rabbit. What are you doing here? You are too close to our village. You must be destroyed. Okay, let me go this way. Oop. I don't know about you guys, but I kind of feel bad. We're killing rabbits here. Oh, how did I dodge? That was weird. Now, I haven't played this game since I was a kid, so I vaguely remember a lot of it. No, actually, I'm lying. I'm, I vaguely remember any of it. I know we get a sword called the Mana Sword. I don't even know if this is it. And I know we get two other characters. And I know the first boss. Because before I started this, I actually played through this first little section here until we defeat the first boss. So, yeah, after that, I'm blind again. Bam. Oh, yeah, double hit. I'm assuming whacked means I got a crit. Ooh, treasure chest. Neat. <laughs> yes. The only way to open up a treasure chest is to shake it, like a piñata. Good job, Vault. You're very smart. Vault's weapon skill up. Okay, yeah, I'm not exactly certain what that does. Guess we'll learn as we go. Hack! Slash, slash, slash. Good night. There's a sign here. Forced off limits. That's a good call. Pro tip, guys. If you need to sneeze, stay away from enemies. Now, you didn't hear it because I cut it out, which, obviously would have destroyed your ears, and I'm not down for that. Oh, there's so many rabbits here. What the heck? Come on. I need to get to, I need to get to the village. You guys need to get out of my way. Nice. Level 2. And one more should do it. Boom. I'm crit hitting these guys a lot. Holy crap. Okay, here we are. We're back at the village. Okay, excuse me, Grandma. We gotta go find the Elder. 
up here. You. Yeah. Vault, you're not hurt. They just told me what happened. I thought you were a goner. I told you it was stupid to bring someone like him along. Ah, oh, you little. He's, a, he's the punk of the group. You idiots. Weren't you told not to go there? See, the Elder has some reason. Huh? Vault, what's that you have? Oh no. It couldn't be. Cool. Did you find the treasure? Way to go. What have you done? How could you have pulled out the Mana Sword? It's impossible. The Mana Sword? Legend has it that our village is finished. If the sword is removed, and here it is. It is said that the Mana Sword has been protecting our village from disaster. Uh-oh. So that's it. That's why all the monsters are attacking us now. Uh-oh. We're in trouble. Look at the guy. He has, a, he has an evil, maniacal look in his face. Looks like he wants to destroy us. How could an outsider like you yank out the sword and bring doom to us all? Okay, so basically in most JRPGs, you have the main character always an outsider of the place he lives in. Pretty standard stuff. Oh, ow, ow. What a, a ass. I wonder if I can use my sword against him. Uh, I guess not. Never mind. You, well, please stop. Uh-oh. What's gonna happen? Whoa, earthquake. Uh-oh. We're in trouble. Hey, look, that guy, that old man kind of looks like the ghost from the sword. Well, I, we saw the ghost in his behind, but that old man we see his friend. Put them together, it probably look the same person. Help, I'm a monster. You have a sword, don't you? Use it. Ah, uh, fine. Hey, can you hear me? Watch how the monster moves before attacking. Oh, that's the old man who came out of the inn. Boom. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh shoot. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I forgot about that. He can knock us unconscious. Ooh. Boom. Boom. Ah. Hey, man. I was like so far away from him. How'd he hit me? Ooh, crit hit. Boom. Oh, yeah. No. Ugh. See, I don't get it. How can he hit us? Like, we're so far away from this dude. Come on. Boom. Ah, oh, crap. Boom. Oh, he's blocking. I didn't know he could do that. Good, darn. Oh, damn. We're dead. Hang on. Clear your mind. Wait till you have 100 some power. And aim carefully. Now, the thing about this, the first boss, you can't actually die. Every time you get to zero, the old man somehow, well, the old man revives you. Yeah, so it's basically like the tutorial boss. Boom. Oh, yeah. Come on, Vault. Get up. Yeah, there we go. See, look at how easy that was. All it took was one revive to beat him. It's kind of lame that we couldn't avoid his acid, acid attack. <laughs> look at him cheer. What a champ. Way to go. Who said that? Got Sword's Orb. You did it! Wait there, I'll pull you up. Oh, thanks old man. Whoa! Yeah, of course. When there's trouble, the big tough guys always run away. That appears to be the real Mana Sword. Huh? What? It is supposed to be pulled out by a knight in times of great trouble. Problem is, you're too young. Something must have happened to the Mana Sword. Here, it's yours. Sorry, but the sword is losing its power and must be re-energized. So you're saying you don't want the sword unless it's fully powered? He's pretty selfish. Only the person who pulled it free can do that. What should I do? Visit Sage Luca in the Water Palace. She's been protecting these lands for over 200 years. Listen to her advice. Okay, so we're gonna go see an old crony. Awesome. It was a crone. Yeah. No, not crony. It's crone. What am I talking about? Vault, the Elder wants you in his house. Well, I have to be off. Oh, my name is Gemma. I'll wait for you inside the Water Palace. Okay, see you later, mysterious old man who's telling us to go, to go power up a mysterious sword that can that save the world before. Elder, we can't go on like this. Yeah, there's no relief in sight. Oh, Vault. You've really done it this time. The reason why monsters have appeared is because you removed the sword. Well, how is the beast boy? Come on, how is he supposed to know? Don't be a jerk. It's settled. We can't let Vault stay in the village anymore. Okay, so this is like reminiscent of when I played Wild Arms. Ah, poor Rudy. Poor Rudy, and poor Vault. If we do, more monsters will come after him. Go. Get out of here. Yeah, on your way now. Oh, you. Seriously, I hate people. Selfish Jack ASS is like these people. I don't want to do this, but I have no choice. I'm going to have to ask you to leave the village. You can take what's in the treasure chest downstairs. Aw, oh, look at Vault. He's just casually walking over and just doing as, as the elder asks without any arguments. Found 50 GP. I assume GP is gill points or gold points. Who's this little girl? Hello? Talk to me. Heading out? See you later. Okay, she doesn't understand what's going on. That's cool. Oh. 
Excuse me, you're in the way. Thanks. Oh, look at them, they all ran off. I took you in and raised you, but there's nothing I can do to help. Please forgive me. Dude, you're kicking me out of the home I've only, I've only ever known. I don't know if I can forgive you, but I'll try for you, father. I know I've told you this before, but your mother brought you to this village when you were just a babe. Oh, we got backstory. Okay, cool. Soon afterwards, she disappeared. I took you and have done my best to raise you, but now we must part. I truly hope you can find your mother someday. Goodbye, Vault. Wow, that sounded very sincere. Okay, so let's see if I can actually buy stuff where the villagers hate me enough to refuse to sell me stuff. Hey, there's that villager who was here before. It feels sad, but there's nothing I can do. It's your fault. Well, it's not. Use a selfie saying, say, go now before something else happens. Okay, looks like people hate me. Yikes. Okay, selfie saying, ooh, that looks like an item sign. I'm only selling you stuff because the elder ordered it. <laughs> well, shot to you too, sir. Now let's see what you've got, good sir. Well, mean sir. Candy, medical herb, cup of wishes. Ooh, cup of wishes. That sounds neat. I have no idea what that is though, so I'm not gonna buy it. Bandana, overalls. Hmm. I don't think I'd want to buy anything. Oh, there's a little face in the candy in the middle. Okay. Oops. How do I cancel? Okay, so cancel is Y. Got it. Okay, looks like um there might that Bandana might be useful, but I'm guessing I could probably find it later on. Hey, they said southeast, southeast exit. Okay, dude, you're in the way. You have everything you need? Yes, I do. Goodbye, weird mustached man. You are hereby banished from Patas, Potas, Potos? Oh, I can barely read that. The background's kind of screwing me up here. Potos. I'm going to go with Potos. Potos Village. Now get out of here. Wow. Thanks a lot. All right. Thank you. Eh, eh, eh. Scary. <laughs> Get away from me! I need, to do, I need to do my outro. Thank you very much for watching Secret of Mana. So anyways, look to the left and you'll find a playlist for Secret of Mana. And you also find a subscribe button in the bottom left. Click that and a notification button to stay notified. And if you're interested in more RPGs, on Monday I stream Super Mario RPG. And on Friday I stream Chrono Trigger. So anyways guys, thank you so much for watching. Come back next time for the next Secret of Mana.